body parts. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix a grinding sunroof motor on a 211 chassis Mercedes-Benz E-Class. The grinding motor is a very common problem, and you can fix it yourself with just a few minutes and a couple small little pieces. So the entire motor assembly for the uh, sunroof here, it's all located under this panel. And all we need to do is drop this panel out and add basically a washer to where the motor is. To do that, um, the first thing I did was clean my hands. Any dirt you have on your hands is going to immediately get on all, all the uh, kind of overhead trim here. So be sure your hands are nice and clean before you start. Um, you'll also need a kind of a pry tool. I know this is dirty, but this won't go anywhere near the, the carpet on the top. You'll also need a T20 um, Torx head screwdriver and basically just your common spring washer. To get the mirror and the old top assembly off, first thing you want to do is pry off this little trim piece right here. That one's actually fairly easy. The harder one is this piece here. This pulls right down. Take your plastic piece and just kind of pry it. That's not a bad noise, even though it sounds like it. Oh. Next, we gotta disconnect the mirror, or unseat the mirror from its housing. Basically, just wanna take it and turn it firmly sideways. It'll pop out and wiggle it forward. SOS button will pop out too. You can just let that hang here. Getting this out is kind of a trick. There are two little push buttons on the inside here. And then the whole piece will just drop right down. This is the noise it's making now. The bolt we need to look at is located right here. If you'll notice, there is a rubber gasket or a rubber kind of O-ring bushing, I guess, that used to be on this bolt. But now it has completely worn away, it's just kind of sitting here dangling. That's allowing the motor to slide up and down, which is causing the gears to misalign and causing the grinding noise you hear. So what I'm going to do is remove this bolt and then there's one in here as well and add that spring washer. This bushing here used to have a little lip on it and that kept the tension on this motor. But now, since there's no tension, this motor is able to rock back and forth. I've got my bolt here with my washer. All I'm going to do is screw that in place. That's it. Literally a $2,000 repair fixed by two five cent washers. Look at that. Now, before you start celebrating, the first thing you should do is buy some um, Mercedes-Benz high-quality sunroof grease. If the sunroof's been stuck closed, all that grease is going to break down, and you'll probably end up frying the motor if you don't grease it up. Move the sunroof back and just grease the rails. Once you're done with that, you can keep on driving and enjoying your sunroof opening and closing like it should. Thanks for watching this video. I'm Corey from ID Parts. Take care. Oh, 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 oh,